welcome everyone today to our third quarterly Greatest Generations Greatest Recipe Contest. This is um, the third time we've done this and we've had a really good success at it. So. Uh, we're happy to uh, be doing this again, and we had five recipes that were submitted this month, so that's that's a good turnout. If we can have five every month, that keeps me and Deidre busy. Um, like I said, welcome, uh, and I want to introduce you to the judging panel today. This is Mrs. Claire Robbins. Um, she should be a good judge. She's submitted recipes in the past and has won both con contest. <laughs> and this is Stephanie Diaz. She's one of our floor girls at CNN. Sonia Munoz is one of the kitchen uh, dietary staff. And then we have Linda Jimenez, who is also one of the residents here. So um, with that, I'll go ahead and start on our first uh, recipe, which is a Christmas cherry pie. And this is submitted by Mrs. Booth. Mrs. Booth couldn't be with us today. She's in the hospital. But um, if you want to go ahead and taste it, girls, and see what y'all think. It's made with um, cherries, and it has nuts, and it also has, um, gosh, what else does it have in it? Um, <laughs> I need to look at the recipe. Is it good? What did y'all think about that, girls? Good. Is it good? All right. Very, very, very good. Okay. Next, we're going to go to the, it's, it's called Poor Man's Dessert. And this was submitted by one of our residents, uh, Sharon Willis. She's here with us today. And this was one of her father's favorites. So it is just a, a family recipe. This is kind of like a bread pudding. It's made with um, biscuits and it has cinnamon and butter and sugar and milk. There you go. Go ahead and take a bite of that. All right, next we're going to go on to the chocolate chip bread, right here. Huh? Oh. We'll get to give all of you a sample here in just a minute, okay? All right. Okay, y'all go ahead and give us a rating on that one. The next one is Mrs. Riley's recipe. She's not here with us today, but it looks really yummy. This one is made with canned uh, cinnamon rolls, and it has chocolate chips and nuts, and it's got a, a glaze on it. You just kind of throw it together in a bunt pan, but it looks so yummy. It really looks like it's a good breakfast uh, dessert or just a dessert for any time of the day. <laughs> Sonia needs one. Okay, our next dessert is going to be the banana cake, and it was also submitted by Mrs. Booth, who couldn't be with us today. But it's a bunt style cake and it looks really good. Let me go ahead and pass that around. Sorry. Oops. Oh. There you go. There you go. Okay, did y'all get to sample that? Mm -hmm. All right, our um, last but not least is called a happy cake. And this was submitted by Mrs. Payne. She's another one of our residents. And Mrs. Payne used to uh, have a little diner herself. And she said this is one of the favorite 
items at her diner. It's just a real simple two, two cups of this, two cups of that, two teaspoons of this, and we had a really nice cake that has pineapple, cream cheese, and nuts. There you go. So if y'all will go ahead and, oops, you didn't get one, I'm sorry. I thought you had one. There you go. Okay, it looks like we have a tie today. After I've taken the tally, there are two desserts that scored um, just excellent grades. And that would be the Happy Cake submitted by Mrs. Payne and the Christmas Cherry Pie submitted by Mrs. Um, Booth, I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, Mrs. Booth. So let's give them a hand. And again, I want to thank everyone for coming and uh, being a part of this. And we're going to pass out some samples for everybody. So thank you again.